Hello, I'm Dr. Dan Johnson, a radiologist at the Mayo Clinic in Arizona, and this is Dr. Wen Shen, Chairman of the Department of Cardiology at Mayo Clinic in Arizona. And we're here to tell you about an exciting collaboration between our departments that allows selected patients to have an MRI examination uh, even though they have a pacemaker. MRI is an exciting uh, imaging technology that allows patients to get diagnoses that previously weren't possible. But patients with pacemakers uh, couldn't have this examination for safety reasons. Uh, and I'm wondering, Dr. Shen, if you could tell the audience uh, uh, some information about this new program that allows selected patients to have this exam now. Thank you, Dan. It is really the beginning of a very exciting collaboration between our two groups. Historically, that uh, in the older versions of uh, pacemakers, there were concerns, especially when pacemakers undergoing examination under the MRI environment, that uh, there were interactions. Interactions uh, that uh, may lead to damage or dysfunction of pacemakers and at times that interactions that uh, may cause harm to patients, particularly if uh, currents can be generated in the magnet field via uh, the pacemaker lead and potentially could cause arrhythmias in these patients. Our center and uh, other centers began to ask the question whether that the pacemaker patients uh, could be safely undergoing MRI examination under selected circumstances. And what we learned is that uh, under a very strict uh, clinical protocol, when patients are monitored, and for those patients that selected patients that in need of MRI scan, that we learned that, that under most circumstances, that uh, the examination with the MRI that can be done uh, in a very safe manner. Is there any data, Dr. Shin, about the potential benefits to these patients? Absolutely. In our first uh, uh, round of experience, about 50 patients, none of the pacemakers had any significant uh, uh, damage or dysfunction. But more importantly, almost all of these patients that, uh, that because of the MRI findings led to either new diagnosis or that leading to a treatment modality which would not have been offered to these patients. So patients that these patients, of course, highly selected, but really benefited that from undergoing MRI scan. What is really unique about this collaboration that uh, at the Mayo Clinic is uh, that uh, during the examination when the patient is in the MRI suite, there is actually a real-time electrocardiogram. So this way that the rhythm of the patient can be monitored in real time. In addition to that, we also have waveforms of the patient's uh, pulses. So we have really these real-time monitoring devices to allow to optimize the safety of the patients. And then afterwards, that we again examine the pacemaker to ensure that the pacemaker has not been affected by the magnet, and so then we follow these patients according to the usual protocol. This program you know, really uh, capitalizes on the unique collaboration between cardiology and radiology at Mayo. What do you think the future of this is? Where is it going? It's, uh, that's an excellent question, Dan. And uh, so we began in a very restricted and limited manner that uh, selecting patients, as I already alluded to, those patients who are not pacemaker dependent, pacemaker is uh, functioning appropriately. We began first uh, with uh, the neurological patients with head and neck uh, MRI scan. We then that expand to those patients that uh, with orthopedic problems that with body scan and currently that we are beginning uh, doing MRI examinations in patients with pacemakers but in need 
of uh, a thoracic chest and cardiac MRI scan. I would emphasize that uh, because that uh, in our clinical practice setting, and uh, your group and our group, we are side by side, and uh, while we have all of these modern technology that we could monitor these patients. If you have a pacemaker and your doctor's ordered an MRI examination, you might find more information about the possibility of this technology for your healthcare by accessing the Mayo Clinic websites in cardiology or radiology. Thank you. Thank you.